Hello, hello, it is me. I wanted to get on and do a read for someone because lately I felt like, you know, I don't know, more called to do them. I don't know if it's like a, a, a thing like planetary wise or what's going on, but I'm just feeling like um, I need to give out more messages or something. But um, Father God, we pray over this read that me and whoever is watching, our intuition will flow through and we will gain the direction and guidance that is needed in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay. Um, what am I going to start with? I think I'm actually going to start with these cards, like for once. Because here lately, like I have really, something about specifics right now when it comes to something and it's been like on me to, to like get into specifics about stuff. Okay, someone has a toxic addiction after traveling someone is addicted to someone's energy okay so we're already starting this out with some bullshit some bullshit okay but somebody is exalted okay someone's still exalted astral traveling because they've they've hit a milestone when it comes to someone astral traveling okay whoever was astral traveling to you is probably a married person um also, someone may have a divine union with someone who is married, unfortunately. Um, the person they're with may have a mental illness. There's, uh, they could be a abundance thief as well. And they're chasing down whoever, whoever this is that's married to them. Okay, this person could be a father. But the spell work has been lifted off whoever this is. Okay. Something about cancer... Green eyes in reverse. Someone someone around you has green eyes and they are in reverse at the moment. Okay, this could mean that they just like are not in a good mood or this could mean that they are in a toxic um, energy right now possibly. It could mean any of these things. Capricorn. Someone has Capricorn in their charts. Okay. This Capricorn is... Um, this Capricorn feels like someone... Okay, someone that has Capricorn in their chart somewhere. Okay. Uh, feels like they have to protect someone from someone that's chasing someone. So a Capricorn feels like whoever their divine union is, that they have to protect this person because they know that there's dark practices and sneak attacks coming their way, okay? This person is a faithful witness to this other person. And if this person thought that this... If anyone was doing fake profiles or anything, it was not this person. This person is a good person. This person's trying to protect you. This person has the angel's assistance with them. That's why anytime anyone tries to put black magic on them, black magic on them, it goes back every time. Okay, that's why. Somebody with blonde hair may have tried to do some kind of um, attack to someone, okay, during the day. But the debt's already been paid for whoever this earth angel is, okay? This other person is just an attention or This could be a Gemini. This Gemini could have blonde hair and green eyes, possibly. This could have been a friends with benefits situation, or this could have just been a friend that you helped out and they helped you out sometimes. They want mercy because they used to be your sidekick. That's what it is. And they're probably going to message you, whoever this is. But you already know that they're phony, okay? This person could be in a karmic couple, okay? I know this is a lot to process, but it's like, okay, someone has Leo in their chart too. Um, what's going on here? If someone has a divine union with someone that's married, okay? That's one thing. Um, whoever this is, though, has got a stalker on their ass. It's a Gemini. Um, and it's th whoever this Gemini is is in a karmic couple that's coming against this woman or this man that has this divine union. Yeah, they've been fucking with their dream state. This could be something about a father or a stepfather or something. Like I said, spell work has been lifted off of you when it comes to father issues. If you've been having to deal with that lately, smile for the camera's busted. Somebody's been busted about something. About alchemizing. Maybe someone knows someone's been alchemizing them into their life or something. An introvert. Someone has noticed that someone has been trying to manifest them. Okay, someone knows this. Uh, spirit blocked. Whoever it is, they're not, they're not blocking this person. They're letting them feel their energy. Something about winter in reverse. Someone may have tried to reach out to someone in the winter time in regards to this. Okay, something about summer. You may reconnect in summer or you may meet this person in summer. Applause in reverse. Someone feels like... Love spells in reverse. Someone feels like 
disappointed at someone when it comes to a love spell or something. Like someone has noticed a love spell backfiring and they're not happy about this. Yeah, energy speaking. Whoever it is, their energy told on them. Yeah, and right now they're being delusional, whoever this is. Something about a society in reverse. This person may be involved in some kind of delusional ass society. Some of those twin flame societies and shit are just like out there, man. Yeah, you got me fucked up in reverse. Somebody's just like, fuck it, I don't care. Yeah, they left. They was like, bye. They're jumping out of this timeline with whoever this is. Yeah, because they worship God. Okay, karmic connection in reverse. Oh, drunken love in reverse. Okay, somebody, um... Someone may like uh, someone when they're tipsy. Okay, this person may want to be your baby daddy. Okay, I don't know who that is. Um, they want to bring you out of a karmic family and they want you to let this karmic family and this karmic connection go, whoever this is. But whoever you are, if you're stuck in this karmic connection, this marriage or whatever, you're calling for SOS to this person because there's shit that is like difficult for you to get out of. Okay, it involves someone that you, someone has brown eyes, the person you're married to may have brown eyes or something. Somebody has neon hair too that's coming, coming to the mix here. Whoever that is. They were trying to give you shitty karma, whoever this is with neon hair, but it's backfired on them. Yeah, because they felt threatened about something. Curiosity killed the cat. This person's already been, like, exposed, whoever this is. Yeah, through your kindred community. Your kindred community already told on whoever this is. Because this person was trying to have you at all costs. Yeah, they were just, like, in your business, whoever that was. Yeah, they were a hot mess, and they've been shown to be a hot mess. You disconnected from whoever this energy is, okay? Because you're helping other people. You don't have time for whoever this person is. Yeah, they want to talk to you, but you're not... You don't want to. You know the ancestors are coming after whoever this person is because they collaborated in a group against you, whoever this is. Yeah, because they thought that you were sleeping on them, but you already knew. Somebody else had red hair that was helping this situation, and they were tarot abusers, okay? These were probably two females that had clicked up together. Someone with neon hair, someone with red hair, and they were trying to come against you in some sort of way, but you already knew about this shit. Also, someone else is very much attracted to you and wants to become your baby daddy. Also, you may be married or something or stuck in a married marriage, but you're going to get help when it comes to that situation because this person that you, you want to be with is going to have to understand that it's not as simple uh, as they may think. I don't know. This is like a lot. <laughs> this is why I don't do these cards because it's a lot of confusing energies coming at one time. It's like, I got this person coming in, this person coming in, this person. It's like you've got a karmic couple coming against you, number one. Some kind of stalker, number two. Two women. That's another one. Uh, whoever you're married to. But regardless of all of this shit, you're the one that's been crowned, okay? You're experiencing growing pains right now, whoever you are. Yeah, because you know that God is... Not on these people's side, so you have to grow, like, away from them. Also, your health. You're having to... This is helping your mental health to be away from these people. Yeah, because they're, like I said, they're terror abusers. If you're a reader, they watch the fuck out of you, and they try to mess with you. Someone with red hair, or you may have red hair. Yeah, sleeping on them. Like I said, there are certain people that are trying to blackmail you out there that you may not even realize are trying to do it, and they may be closer than you think. Yeah, there may also be a male involved. Like I said, karmic couple. Because they have different beliefs. Whoever these people are. Because god damn it. People won't let people live. Their group collaborating on this shit. Like, because they all feel like. Ride or die for each other in this situation. But like I said. You're of the house of Jacob. God is your ride or die. Okay. Because like. Once again. In all of these. You're the holy grail. To God almighty. And you're priceless to him. And he's not letting you go anywhere. Okay. Doesn't matter about these family issues. It does not. The cops have come in on this situation. Someone may have a raid coming up, okay? Or someone may get caught with some kind of, like, drugs, possibly. People need to be careful. Whoever this blessing blocker is, whoever it is that's trying to block these blessings might get in trouble with the police, okay? Or it may just be spiritually that people are going to come, like, the angels are going to come in and take care of this person. Someone has hazel eyes, okay? That was a nosy gossiper, but... They've been shown for what they are at this point. Something about a Virgo. Quiet time. Something about a Virgo needs to have quiet time right now. Or you need quiet time with a Virgo or something. 
something about wealth in reverse because this Virgo feels like their wealth has been stolen from them or someone with Virgo in their chart somewhere. Get your popcorn in reverse. This person knows that they're not going to be the one getting whatever it is that they're, they were so clingy about. They were very clingy about something, but they're not getting whatever it is. Baby mama, maybe they wanted to have a child with you. They're not going to get that because you're not going to be fruitful with them. Yeah, you had to ghost this person because this person was a clown. Yeah, cutoff game in reverse. They're trying to get back in touch with you and you may be talking to them, but you need to remember that this person is a dark spiritualist and they've been trying to come against you. They've already been humbled, but clearly not enough because they're still coming around you because they feel like you're popular and they want to suck off that. They think that you two have some kind of secret soul connection and that you're their wish, but it's all in reverse. It's not, it's not for whoever this is. This person needs to get off your radar and out of your energy, okay? Something about a Pisces in reverse. Somebody is dealing with a Pisces in reverse with brown hair or somebody with Pisces in their chart uh, whoever that is you may come back into contact with possibly or something someone with Pisces in their chart with brown hair you may reconnect with or something my way or the highway it didn't work out in the past with whoever this is because they were too arrogant uh, they were a hot mess back then but um, then their heart got broken whoever this is by a Sagittarius possibly in the fall uh, they thought this person was a kindred community to them. This could have been a lover. This could have been a friend. This could have been a father figure. I don't know. But they didn't want this person to have a new life, okay? So they had to run away from them. Okay, it caused them PTSD, possibly, because there was so much things threatening, threatening them from other people's shitty karma that they had to meditate away from it. There may have been a Taurus in reverse as well that was codependent and power hungry. Something about children. Pray over your children right now, whoever you are. <sighs> Something about drinking. Be careful with your drinking. Around someone with brown eyes, possibly. Smile for the camera's busted. This person's calling for help because they've been shown for something. They're an introvert. They probably are obsessed with you, whoever this is. But don't drink anything from this person, whoever this is. Because the spell work has been lifted from whatever the whatever shit they were trying to alchemize that didn't work out that person has leo in their chart somewhere okay and that person is attracted to you so they've been trying to do something to you but don't drink after whoever this is okay i don't know who that is i don't think it was the pisces person with the brown hair i think that was a different energy god damn i don't know what's going on okay uh this may make sense this may not make any sense to somebody out there but for whatever reason i'm getting it out and um it's obviously meant to be put out or you know I wouldn't have been called to do it. But I'm going to come back on in a minute and do one. Um, someone has a sacred contract and they're meant to have some kind of baby daddy, okay? These, they're supposed to be a power couple with someone. Um, yeah. But somebody is codependent on a Taurus, okay? I don't know where that comes in. Or someone with Taurus in their chart. I don't know. They may have met them in the spring. But curiosity is going to kill the cat in that relationship. They're going to find something out about that person. I don't know. Maybe one part of this will resonate. Maybe multiple parts will resonate. There, it's all over the place, and it's a lot of different energy. So it's like somebody feels threatened, and someone's a runner too. It could be from their father. I don't know. Somebody. Yeah, divine masculine, divine feminine cheater. Somebody is gonna have to like sneak out of an out of one connection to be with another person. Because they regret who they're with and they want to help others with this new person. Yeah, to fight these dark spiritualists out there. Like, whoever this is wants to leave whatever connection they're in to go into this new life with this other person. Because they know that this person and them uh, will help others and be good to others. They won't be heartbroken and miserable with this other person because it's, you know, it's their match. They came out together. So... But somebody's going to have to sneak out of something, okay? Like, you can't be arrogant and my way or the highway about this and then just disconnect with them if it doesn't go your way. You're going to have to be more flexible, okay? Something about a mother, answer the angel's call. Something about brown hair. I don't know, someone's mother uh, may have brown hair. Answer the angel's call. You may need to call your mother or something or pray for your mother. You need to watch out for Pisces that may be homeless or becoming homeless right now. Keep them on your radar, whoever they are, because they're in your business right now. They're trying to send you mental attacks, whoever this Pisces is, or somebody with Pisces. Patience. You need to have patience. But this person, this person's wanting to rush in and, like, vex you and piss you off because they're about to become homeless or some shit. 
But fuck that. It doesn't matter if they rush towards you. You just, you be patient for your wish, okay? Because it's on its way, okay? Your cutoff game with all these clowns have really um, helped bring this connection together, okay? Um, all right, well, I love you all very much. Thank you for watching this video. And like I said, I will be back on in a little bit. Like I said, take what resonates and what doesn't, leave it. There's many, 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 piece, like, pieces. Woo, there's many, many pieces in this read. So, if any of it uh, resonates, that would that's great. I hope parts of it did, because I know it's not going to resonate 1,000% for anyone. There's no fucking way. It was a lot. But, I mean, unless somebody really has all these energies, like, exact on point, like I'm calling them out, I don't know. But, okay. Whoever it is, uh, you need to think, because something that you're going to think about or figure out or something is going to bring you wealth. There's something about... <sighs> Someone's also clingy about watching someone or being around someone, but there's something that they need to sit in their quiet time. It's going to bring them wealth in some way. Some, like bringing in their blessings or bringing in their wealth or something. I don't know. Whoever this is... Yeah, facts. Whoever this is... Um, Boss bitch activated. They need to continue activating their gifts because, you know, they're a baddie. And when, um, they have this quiet time is when they can manifest, yeah. They need to, yeah. Somebody feels like withdrawals when you're not around them. Some Or when someone's not around someone, they get withdrawals off this person. They don't like when this person isn't talking to them or around them. It makes them feel like maybe they're a snob. Someone with black hair possibly. Or you may have black hair. But the ancestors have, like, been... What is this snob shit about is what I would like to know. They think you're a snob? Well, you know what? The ancestors have come in and clarified that you're not a snob when you're an icebox to this person. I don't know. That's just how somebody feels about you. It could be a Libra. But it's like, this person can fight all they want and try to fight you all they want. But at the end of the day, what's gonna be is gonna be. Okay, yeah. So, if you feel like you don't want to forgive them right now, you may need to because they're coming in. Okay? This, you may be dreaming about this person. Someone's an ascended master. And they're like, they were trying to teach a lesson, but it went back on them in some way. Because they were being ungrateful about this divine union somebody was. But they're watching whoever you are, like, a lot. They feel a lot towards you. That's good. And they're praying for you, whoever they are. Whoever this energy is, I don't know. They need to surrender, though, to, to the truth of whatever this connection is. And they need to speak up, whoever this is. You know, they need to ground themselves more, possibly. Or you may need to. Something about their third eye needs to be more open. Copycat in reverse. They need to have their third eye open so they can notice copycat energies around them. Like, people that are trying to embody their real person's energy so that they don't fall into that trap. Something about famous in reverse. Anger issues. Someone's anger issues is going to make them not look good. Something about an Aries. Someone needs to chill on their anger or it's going to make them look bad. Okay? That's for someone else. Okay. Alright. But I love you guys very much. Uh, I don't know what all this is about, but you've been crowned over it. Okay? And uh, I'll be back on later with a better one. Okay? But I love you guys. I will talk to you later. Okay? Bye.